everyone, welcome back to my channel. This week I have a plan with me for you um, using this kit from Wild Sunshine Co. I've had it for a little while and to me it's kind of like a wintery, springy kit at the same time, so I figured this was a good week to use it. I have a few of these like transition week kits that are perfect for this time of year when it's still kind of cold but like we're getting into spring. So anyway, I was just showing you the pages of the kit and now I'm starting by putting down the bottom washi. Um, this kit has a lot of like silver glitter, but also my two favorite color, com like my color, favorite color combination, which is um, purple and teal. So I was pretty obsessed with this kit the entire time I was putting it down. I was really loving it. So moving up to my sidebar, there was no quote box or anything like that, so I just picked one of the decorative full boxes and put that in the top corner. Then I used a glitter washi strip underneath that and this little arrow that says clean and a little maid sticker from Miscellany Boulevard. Then I put down the weekly ombre just to mark a weekly cleaning list, followed by another glitter uh, washi strip and a habit tracker to mark my no spend this week which didn't go very well, I might add. Um, then I added a little sticker from Once More With Love that says no spend jail because that's really how it feels. <laughs> and then a, another glitter washi strip and then the kit I think comes with ombre boxes but you can buy them a la carte so I didn't pick those up since I never use them. So I just pulled another ombre checklist from a different kit that I had from Oh Hello Michelle and added a blank header on top to write in happy mail. That little glitter mailbox is from the kit, so I just threw that in to fill the space and then just um, wrote down some of the happy mail that I'm expecting this week or that I ordered this week and probably won't get here until next week, but that's okay. Um, just filled in that weekly cleaning list and then moved on to putting down the date covers. And I pulled them all off the sheet and then just stuck them on the um, coil so that they didn't get stuck to anything random, but I didn't have to keep going back to the sheet. Going on to Monday, I started off with a to-do header and then a be-do sticker from Oh Hello Michelle that says Case of the Mondays. Um, and then I wrote bleh because, you know, Mondays <laughs> can do that to you. Then I just used this little skinny appointment label with a little phone icon from the kit and wrote that I had to call Sprint Customer Service and I used that really in the, like angry munchkin and the FML from what uh, from the Coffee Monsters Co because this was like the third time I had to call them about the same thing and I was getting really irritated so it seemed appropriate. Then I just put down a half box and wrote that I had to stop by my leasing office for my apartment and a side eye bear from Bubba Bear Studio because again this was like the third time I had to contact my leasing office about another issue so Monday was full of good stuff. <laughs> Uh, underneath that, I put down a Gertie from, like, the little unicorn from Willow Wallow Co. and a Treat Yourself sticker to mark that I went to Dunkin' Donuts. Followed that with a full box and that little Sunny um, on the computer from Wild Sunshine Co. to mark that I spent the afternoon designing new stickers. Um, at night, I went out with my friends to a movie. We saw Get Out. I don't know if any of y'all saw that, but um, let me know what you thought if you did. We had some we had some thoughts. <laughs> um, anyways, so moving on to Tuesday, I put down a Today header just to start it off and then that Insomnia Munchkin from Once More With Love to mark that I got zero sleep the night before and no, it was not because the movie was scary. <laughs> um, that little sleeping cat on the side is from Ohana Story and I just wanted to um, bring in another little decorative sticker so I stuck that down. Um, I cut down a glitter washi strip into a flag and used that to put next to the payday sticker just to fill the space a little bit better. Then I just put down a full box from the kit and a Is It Bedtime Yet Be Due from Oh Hello Michelle because I was so tired that day and it's just like all I could think about. Um, then I put down that little squiggle is from the kit. It's just one of the decorative things that she has in, in the kit so I did that to break up the space a little bit and then put down a half box with an arrow and an important header from the kit as well to write down that I had a meeting. I put down that scale because Tuesdays are normally my weigh-in days, but this week I ended up not weighing in. Um, for some reason, I don't know, 
I really have no excuse why, I just didn't get around to it. So that will stay blank, but uh, then I put down a glitter header and these two TV little things to mark some shows that I watched that night. So I watched This Is Us and The Voice, and I caught up on The Voice from the night before because we're still in the uh, time of year where it's on like three times a week. So, um, And if you guys are still watching This Is Us, oh, I'm so sad that it's about to end. It's like... One, there's like one episode left until they go away for the season. So I just filled in some more space uh, with some deco and then moved on to Wednesday. I started off with a to-do glitter header um, up at the top and then a skinny appointment label that I moved down just to make room for that laptop and marked in that I had to email my school about something to do with my financial aid. So yeah, I had to do that first thing in the morning and then put down the uh, this coffee is my love language sticker from Lily, Lily Henry, I think. Uh, then I just spent the afternoon working on orders, so I put down a full box with a print, cut, and pack icon from Obsessed with Q. I have like a thousand sheets of those stickers, so I usually throw them all down at the same time because why not? Um, it fills the space and I get to use up some of my stickers. I seriously have like 50 sheets of those. Anyway, so I put down another squiggle and a little tether from the kit and a meal plan sticker from my shop that just got released this Friday, so those are new. Um, I put some deco in there to fill the space and then put down a glitter half box to mark that I was designing once I had finished with orders. I finished off Wednesday with another TV little thing from the kit to mark that I watched Big Little Lies on HBO. I read that book, and so I've been like obsessed with the show ever since it came out. I think we're on like episode three. And normally it's funny because I don't really have a lot of TV shows, but whenever I do, they seem to all pile up on top of each other. So right now I'm watching like three different TV shows, but other times during the year I have nothing on TV that I'm interested in. So I don't know if that's by design on the TV part or what. But anyways, moving on to Thursday, I put down a Today header and then a full box with this sleep in sticker from Lexi Kylie Designs. I need to order, I don't even know if she still sells those, it was like one of the first stickers I ever ordered from her, but if she does, I need to order some more because I'm almost out. <laughs> uh, then I put down another blank header and a half box in the middle section with this camera uh, blobby from Oh Hello Stationery Co. to write down that I had to take listing photos for new releases that were going up on Friday. Then that afternoon, I went grocery shopping, so I used this purple grocery shopping cart sticker from my kit, or from my shop, and then a glitter appointment label from the kit to mark that I got Starbucks while I was grocery shopping. That's really how I get through grocery trips. There's a Starbucks in the store, so I go in, like, get my cart, and then get Starbucks, and then I'm like, alright, let's do this. <laughs> Anyway, so those dog bath stickers are new to my shop as well, so I was just showing that you could get them with or without the words. I chose the ones without the words, and I wrote them in, even though they say the exact same thing, thing as the ones with the words. I don't know. I just felt like being difficult. <laughs> then this Clean All the Things, it's a little hard to read, but you can read it in person. Um, it's just glitter, and it's from the kit as well. And then I used two asterisk stickers from the kit to mark down a couple of uh, little tidying up things I wanted to do around the house. And that vacuum sticker is from Lexi Kylie Designs as well. Moving on to Friday, I started off with a to-do glitter header and then put down, oh, then I went in and filled in uh, the dates because I realized I had forgotten to do that. Then I put down this TGIF Beedoo who's like face planted into the ground because he's exhausted from the week and that's pretty much what I was feeling. And only because I slept like five hours the whole week. It was a really bad sleeping week. Anyways, um, I put in that tiny little work-life grump lump from Grumble and Kind. She just started doing, um, I think she calls them pint size stickers. So the little, little tiny ones, which is perfect for adding into a full box or something like that, to write in that I was writing listings that morning to put the new releases up at 12, which is what I'm up now. Beneath that I just put down this little arrow that also came with the kit to mark that I wanted to make a sale graphic and um, post that to Instagram and Facebook to go along with new releases. And that little sale bag is from uh, Once More With Love. 
and then that new release is Munchkin is also from Once More With Love. I put down a pattern washi strip and a laundry day sticker from Lexi Kylie Designs to mark my laundry, and then a half box from Little Red Prince with a don't forget label from the kit that I needed to get in my PVC application. And then down at the bottom I put down a this is me now little bundled up girl from Willow Wallow Co. Up at the top of the weekend, I put in two pattern washi strips to cover up the headers and then put in this gorgeous weekend banner that is like glitter with flower, like the flowers on the side. I just think it's so pretty. So I put that down and then this little Willow Wallow Co. sticker says, it's cold out there, I'm staying in here. Um, when I got up that morning, that's really how I felt. I didn't want to get out of bed. It was so cold this weekend in North Carolina. Um, anyways, after that, I got out of bed and had a coffee candle morning, which I do every now and then when I just need, like, a relaxing start, just have my coffee and read a book or do something really low-key. Uh, that little sticker says, no buts about it, or no buts, just do it, and that's from Once More With Love, and that's to mark that I had to, I have to get started on my Go Wild swag. I signed up to do the swag bags. Um, if you guys are in... PGW or were in PGW, I'm curious to know what you think about contributions to swag bags. I'm really like not a fan of how that all went down in the group and I really don't know that I still want to do it and I know a bunch of shops are pulling out which is not really fair for the people still going. I just don't really know where I, where I fall in that whole thing. Anyways, then I put down a half box to mark that there was one week to to um, this party that my friends throw every year. I'm super excited, so I just wanted to put down that to mark the occasion. And then down at the bottom, I just did a Today header with a full box and then that little drink sticker from Paper Kiss to mark that I went downtown with some friends and we went back home afterwards to watch the ACC tournament game or championship game. I don't know, I don't watch it. I, just, I watched it, but I didn't really care. <laughs> Anyways, uh, Sunday morning, like I was saying, it's, it was super, super cold this weekend, and we actually woke up to some snow, and I know that like, snow here is a joke anywhere else, but it was, I don't know, it stuck to the ground, so that's pretty serious, right? So that little guy in the ice is a Bidu sticker from Oh Hello Michelle. I put down a Bubba Bear Studio Side Eye Bear, and then a Side Eye Emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. as well. Then in the middle, I did a full box from the kit and this Grump and Donuts, uh, Grump Lump from Grumble and Kind to mark that I went to Dunkin' Donuts that day to, have, to get a little pick-me-up and I came back home to work on some orders. Next I put down this half box from Bubba Bear Studio that says, Hey Procrasti Pants, because I still hadn't done my PVC application from the day or from Friday I guess it was and the deadline was like Monday so I really needed to get it done. If you guys haven't gone over to that Facebook group or their Instagram to vote for your favorite shops, um, I would love you so much if you went and voted for Rack Paper Stickers to be included in the next uh, PPC sale. Anyways, down at the bottom I just put down a Grumbling Kind Grumpalump who's covered in snow and then a Bee Doo hiding behind like this igloo thing and wrote, it's too cold. <laughs> I don't really get a chance to use all the snow stickers so I figured I would throw as many in on Sunday as I could because snow is not real common down here. So anyways, I was just showing you what's left of the kit and here's another close-up look at the spread overall. I hope you guys really liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you would like to see more videos in the future. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!